So today in this video we shall learn to find the square root of 3969 by prime factorization method. So to find out square root by prime factorization method, first of all we have to find out the prime factors of given number. So we have given number is 3969. So now we have to find out the prime factors of it. So it is 3 times 1 means 3, 3 times 3 means 9, like as 3 times 2 means 6 and 3 times 3 means 9. So again it is 3 times 4 means 12, remaining here is 1, so 1 to 12, so 3 times 4 means 12 and 3 times 1 means it is 3. So now we have to find out the prime factors of 4, 4, 1. So it is so it is 3 times 1 means 3 so remaining is 1 1 for 14 so 3 times 4 means 12 remaining is 2 so 2 1 21 so 3 times 7 means 21 so it is 3 times 4 means 12 so remaining is 2 2 7 27 so 3 times 9 means 27 so it is 7 times 7 means 49. So we have taken out the prime factors of 3969. So now we find out the square root. So a square root of 396 sorry 3969 is equal to so we are finding a square root so this sign is the sign of a square root and a square root of 39 six nine so it is equal to so now we write all the prime factors of three nine six nine so it is one two three four times three so one two three four times three like as seven times seven so we have written down all the prime factors so now we make the square of these prime factors so three times three means it is three square 3 times 3 again 3 square and 7 times 7 it is 7 square so as you look closely all these numbers contain a square so we, we can write 3 times times 3 into 7 whole a square so we have taken here a square as a common from all these numbers so a square and a square would cancel each other so the remaining part is 3 times 3 times 7. So 3 times 3 means 9 and 9 times 7 means it is 63. So the square root of 3969 is 63. So this much for today and if you have any question related to math and science then just comment your question in a comment below and we shall provide a video solution of your question. So thank you.